So if, you know, someone listening in and they're kind of looking to get started, maybe they go, they went through something similar or they need to, right? Maybe they need to reevaluate some things. I think we all do probably on a regular basis. Um, is there any advice, any insight you'd share, any guidance to, to push them in a certain direction that might be helpful for them getting started? The biggest, I mean, to me, it's, it's, it's taking action and having accountability. And I know for me, it's been imperative that I have accountability partners. And, you know, I even talk about in Save Your Asks, just the importance of someone that you can get like essentially butt ass naked with, right? Like someone that you can be totally vulnerable with and they'll call you out on your stuff. But that person also needs to act as that accountability partner. And you know, my friend, Tommy Breedlove, who has a great book called Legendary, um, which I think has a lot of these great foundational pieces in it. Um, but he has this exercise where it's like, um, if you, what's the one thing that if you added or removed to your life would have the greatest impact and starting there. Right. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I think programs like 75 hard is a good, like gut check, right? Like what does life look like without alcohol? And I'm like, listen, I love when people drink or like throw gummies around. Like yeah. I, it actually makes me a lot more, it, it makes conversation easier. Cause I go deep pretty quick. Yeah. I'm not against that, but uh, I think, you know, finding that moderation for some of us is super important or getting rid of it. And so I think programs like 75 hard are, are really good for kind of taking you down and resetting getting what does good night's sleep really feel like? And you'll get it during those 75 days. I don't know if you're familiar with 75. I am. Hard. Yeah. I have a few friends that have done that. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, so, I mean, I think it's taking action more than anything and then mm -hmm. finding that accountability partner to take action. But I love that exercise Tommy does, which is like, what's that one thing that you could add or take away from your life? It might be walking two miles if you haven't worked out in a long time. Yeah. Um, and then you, you just add to that over time. What I don't like is like the, oh yeah, I'm going to do dry January. And then everyone just goes back to their old ways. Right. Okay. Like, or blow it out I mean, February 1st. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So yeah. I mean, taking action is one of the most important pieces Yeah, in that accountability. No, I, and, and again, it's one of those things I think, you know, you've kind of proven over the last, whatever dozen, 15 years, even of kind of continually reinventing yourself, looking at that and then saying, where am I in life and how do I want to improve and get better? And again, there, I, I think one of the biggest things, certainly like stopping drinking is a big thing, but there's also small tweaks, right? Sure. It doesn't have to be the greatest thing in the world, just small little tweaks, that consistency over time. You know, I think I, you mentioned earlier about the, the, uh, the tenacity. Um, I kind of like that as if you put that effort into it, chances are you can build consistent processes. 100%. So, 